This is a review of my 2012 GT Series 5 road bike. I've put a little over 2,000 miles in it. This bike retails for $770. I purchased it for $500. One thing I love about this bike is that the whole bike is filled with brand name components and parts. Uh, the frame is a 6061 aluminum. Uh, this bike is uh, 49 centimeters. The fork is carbon fiber. Uh, they call it a, a GT Road Design carbon blade. Although the steer is only uh, aluminum. But uh, the headset's a FSA. The crank set is also a FSA. FSA Tempo Compact, what they call it. It has a uh, 5034 teeth. The cassette is a Sunrace HG 8 speed. Um, I don't know if you need to know the bottom bracket, but it's also FSA sealed cartridge uh, uh, square taper. Uh, the front derailleur is a Shimano 2300. So are the rear. They're also Shimano 2300. The shifters, they are micro shift. R82, dual control. Again, 8 speed. The chain, they're KMZ or KMC, HG48 speed. I replaced the pedals, but they're the strap ones. This one is the Wilgo. Aluminum pedals. Brake levers are also micro shift R82. Handlebar. The handlebar is a GT design shallow drop road version. The stem is a GT design 3D forge 6061. The seat post is a GT2 bolt alloy, 31.6 by 300. The saddle is a GT biomorphic dual density saddle, pretty comfortable. The rims. They are the Jalco DRX 4000. I don't know if you need to know the hubs, but I don't know what they are. Uh, the tires. I already replaced the tires. I didn't like the the tires that came with. It's a Schwalbe Lugano 700 by 23C. Uh, I got a lot of flat tires with that, but it's supposed to be really good tires. I replaced them with the all condition armadillo by Specialized. Way better. I like the geometry of uh, this bike. I like the way it's uh, designed. You can tell that it's designed to go fast. I'm looking at the handlebar and the stem. And see how this, there's not a lot of spacers here. And the handlebar is... Dropped, unlike my uh, other bike, the Scatante CFR LE carbon frame. Uh, the stem is actually a little bit more up, and it's a little bit taller, so you know it's designed for uh, endurance or um, long ride or long distance uh, rides. But 
this one seems like it's designed for speed. Uh, the fastest I've gone on a downhill is a, a little less than 50 miles per hour, 49.7. And that maxed out the crank set. Um, couldn't pedal anymore. Uh, I have that in uh, one of my videos, so you can check that out. Actually, no, I'm sorry. No, I don't have that in my video. I never recorded that. But I do have it in my um, Strava app. Uh, would I recommend this uh, bike to a friend? I would. Although they don't make the GT Series 5 anymore. But I would still recommend um, GT road bikes to friends. Uh, they're good quality bikes. They're uh, The prices are uh, not that expensive for aluminum. And I'm telling you, the... The Shimano 2300, for me, they really shift very well. Again, um, GT Series 5, good entry-level bike, good trainer bike. Highly recommend it.